Leticia Romero got to take a trip back home while participating in the International Basketball Federation World Championships, more commonly known as the FIBA tournament. Home for her just happens to be across the globe in Spain. She was picked along with another former FSU guard, Leonor Rodriguez, to represent the Spanish women's national team. Rodriguez is 23 years old, making Romero the youngest player at the tournament at age 19. But she didn't let it slow her down. That was a, a great experience. I mean, I, I never thought I was gonna make it this year because I was really young to, to be on the, on the team, but it was like a surprise, a nice surprise, and I, I couldn't believe it at first, but then the experience was amazing. So I was really happy to, to be able to have that opportunity. This will be Romero's first year on the Florida State basketball team. The point guard has fallen in love with Tallahassee and picked up English as a second language. She'll be redshirting her sophomore year, but we'll have three more years to play starting next fall. They talk a lot about uh, what that experience is like for the players. It's just such a sense of pride that, that they've developed into the type of players that are uh, competing against the best in the world. And to have two of them on the same team from the same place is just, uh, it was a dream come true. She amazes me because if you think about it, this is her fourth team in six months. She must be extremely adaptable, you know, to be able to go from finishing at another university in the United States to going to her level national team, to the senior national team, and now with us for the last couple of weeks. It's not just her scoring. She averages about 14 points a game. And it's not her willingness to pass the ball, dishing out about five assists. It's her lockdown defensively that makes her so versatile as a player. She's very, very heady. And I've, I've had a couple of uh, very heady point guards that uh, I love to coach. Uh, I think, too, she's the kind of point guard that is not only a distributor, but she's somebody that can shoot the basketball. She can score in a lot of different ways. Uh, she's probably a better defender than, um, than I anticipated and a better defender than some of the, those type of point guards I've had in the past. Romero has been playing basketball since the age of nine on the streets of the Canary Islands. Even though she is thousands of miles away from her family, Romero has found a new home at Florida State with her teammates. It was hard at first because um, of the language. I didn't know much English um, and it was a long process to be able to understand people, to be able to communicate. But um, for the culture, I think it's not Mm, it's not that different. I mean, it's just people and it's just basketball. I really enjoy uh, playing in the United States. Fans can look forward to seeing Romero running point next season and bringing the little Spanish flair to the Seminoles. Reporting for Seminole Sport Magazine, this is Courtney Wagner.